Hey, good morning, you guys. We're inside the MQF or mobile quarantine facility. This one was actually used on Apollo 14, but it's very similar to the one that was used on Apollo 11. And this is right about where it was situated when the crew of Apollo 11 came back to Earth and lived inside that mobile quarantine facility. We are aboard the USS Hornet, which played a critical role in the Apollo 11 mission. This is Mike McCarran, the executive director of the US Horn USS Hornet Air, Sp Sea and Space Museum. Sierra Space Museum, right. Something like that. Yes. <laughs> Welcome aboard. So, yeah, this was the recovery ship for the first two manned missions to the moon, Apollo 11 and Apollo 12. And we now have a full exhibit dedicated to the Apollo program, everything from Mercury, Project Mercury, through Gemini, and the Apollo, of course, the, the moon landings. And as I was studying my history, what blew me away is that they came all the way back from the moon and splashed down just 13 miles from where this ship was stationed out in the Pacific. Right, and that was considered not a good, good they, they, they want to be closer, actually. But they got well within 13 miles, um, which is amazing considering the computer technology used to make those calculations to, for the navigation. Uh, they splashed down. The helicopter, much like this one over here behind us, went out to pick up the astronauts. And they brought them back. And the helicopter was put on the hangar deck here. Astronauts walked over. And as you can see, we have these footprints memorialized of the astronauts coming off the helicopter and walking into the um, uh, MQF the Marine, um, mobile quarantine facility. So that helicopter would have been sitting right here, and this is where Neil Armstrong touched down from the moon on Earth. These are technically his first steps on back on Earth. Wow. So uh, we're very proud to have him here. It's a great attraction, and it's uh, just part of the whole museum experience here. Well, let's go over here, because you have something very special here for a limited time. This is my first time aboard the USS Hornet. I will be back. <laughs> it's your chance to tour an aircraft carrier and one that played such a critical role in our nation's history. And this right here on special loan? Right. This is on loan to us and our friends at NASA Ames on a Mountain View at Moffett Field. Inside that Lucite pyramid is a moon rock that Apollo 16 brought back to us. And uh, we got it on display this week to celebrate uh, this, what we call Splashdown 50, the 50th anniversary of the Apollo landing. And you have something going on pretty much every day of the week. How can people learn more about what the different programming you have going on? Sure, we do. We started yesterday with some events. Uh, we're going to culminate really on, on Saturday with a big uh, open party for the community and a gala in the din uh, dinner in the evening with many of the crew members. If you want more information, our website, uss-hornet.org has all the information how you can buy tickets to the, the event on Saturday or the dinner Saturday night. Meet some of the crewmen who flew the helicopters, the divers who went to the water to get the astronauts. They're all going to be here, so uh, please come down and see us. All right, so you can touch, meet, and actually walk in the footprints of Neil Armstrong. Back to you guys.